here with head coach Joel Abelson. Uh, coach, talk about your first uh, win as a head coach there on Saturday night. Well, it was a good win, good team win. Um, we played a lot better in the second half. You know, it's one game. For me, it was great to get the first one under under my belt, but you know, it's the same with this team. It was great to get the first one under our belt, but we got to get ready for Springfield on Friday, so that's what we're doing. What are some things uh, that you need to work on before the next uh, next game? Well, our defense is a work in progress. Um, you know, defensive rebounding is something that we've stressed all week and we'll continue to stress. And sharing the basketball offensively. We're a really talented group, but you know we tend to, um, you know, one pass shot. We need to move the ball and make plays for ourselves and each other. Were there any players that surprised you with their uh, play on Saturday? Um. You know, I got, we got really good performances from, from everybody. I mean, everybody played and, and um, everybody contributed very positively. I mean, Brian Boyles came off the bench in the third quarter after not playing and made two threes and got three very tough rebounds, which is very difficult to do after sitting for an entire half. So we were pleasantly surprised with him. You got uh, Springfield and Maine this weekend. Uh, just tell our fans what to expect out of those games. Yeah, two tough tests. I mean, uh, Bob McKenna and I worked for him. Uh, three seasons ago in Idaho, they're going to be very well prepared for us. Um, they got James Mays in the middle, who's probably one of the best big men in our league, and probably definitely is. Um, and Ben Uzo, who played in the NBA last year for a few different times. So, you know, that's going to be a tough test for us. Um, it's a winnable game, a game that we, we feel we, we will go and win. Um, in Maine, you know, they have um, two guys down from the Celtics, and they're you know, they're a real talented group, but um, you know we're, we're excited about the opportunity to get to play against them and, and be seen by you know the Boston Celtics scouts who are watching their own guys. So our guys should be pumped up for that. That'll be good.